Hello, Hello Floss Tube. We're the Real Housewives of Cross Stitch. I'm Priscilla. And I'm Chelsea. This is Piper. Ronnie. And we're here to talk to you about our stitching this week. Okay. Uh, as you saw on Instagram and Facebook, Mom got to visit with uh, baby Jojo. Let's show this and get this out of the way first and then we'll talk. Okay. Um, so these are the four fall tiered tray tidbits plus there's a bonus one I'll show you I'm stitching that one so I'll show you that and this was this week's which is the pumpkin patch pumpkin. with the wheelbarrow and the pumpkins and this truck came from um, Walmart. Walmart they also sell it in a white version but mine did not have the white version I think I might have liked the white one better but Destiny still sent us a adorable. picture of her tiered right. tray and mom was like I gotta get it <laughs> She got my old tear tray. Right? Yeah. Yeah. She yeah. got my old round one. Yep. So um, the pumpkins come in this, but I did boo down the greenery and I added some bows in between them and I added some of the Lori Hope vintage trim around it. Yep. And we had pumpkin farm, uh, fall jar, and then uh, pumpkin seeds. Okay. So we'll take this down and then we'll talk. Was that new? What? That one in the middle? No. Oh, you already? No. It's been there since last year, I think. Oh. <laughs> anyway, I, I got to go see Baby Jojo and my son and daughter-in-law, and I had a really good time. It was fun. Hard to leave. I was crying a little bit at the airport, and there was this man sitting across from me, and I thought that he he just kept staring at me and then he got up and I thought oh my god he's coming over here and I was worried and <laughs> oh it's horrible what's wrong it's sad when you have to come home she said she um posted a ton of pretty pictures though they live right by the ocean so you can see mm -hmm. the beautiful sunsets and everything and when we were on a walk one day they had sent us a picture of it before and they said we think this is one of your people because <laughs> oh, yeah, they funny. had a flag wreath and I did include that flag wreath in my slideshow that was from TikTok and it's on Instagram and everything. So that's your wreath. I work by her house. <laughs> um, I think that's all we did, right? Stitched. Mm -hmm. I had a sick one at home, so I was a caretaker all week and just like terrified I was going to get it. So, um, you went to the beach, picked up some rocks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He wants his uncle to play the game with him anymore. <laughs> so he's probably right now. All right, go sit on the couch and eat your yogurt, okay? Um, all right, so we had some questions from last week. Pa last week, Polly wanted to know, do you take your stitching with you as carry-on when you fly? And if so, any tips to make it easy to do so while flying? Absolutely. But the, the one thing I will say is I don't use hoops or um, cue snaps or anything like that. So my stitching is very portable. I can also stitch with just the light on the plane. I don't need to bring an extra light, even though sometimes when I've flown at night, it has come in handy. But I always have my stitching in my carry-on bag. That's like what my carry-on bag's about. And I use our Stitching with Housewives tote bag. It has a zipper. I use this, and then my purse also fits in here. So this is my carry, or my personal, personal item. item. And then I bring a rolling suitcase. And I stitched all the way there and I stitched all the way home. I was working on our Mrs. Claus Bakery. Yeah. So we'll show you that in a few minutes. Yes. Uh, you just have to make sure that the scissors are less than three inches, which right. I mean, any scissors typically are. If Those you are somebody who needs a light, we have uh, like clip on auto lights in our um, Amazon shop that we've used before. She also has a couple other lights that she's used in there that are really portable to use. Okay, so you can use like the, the kid scissors and they're on sale now at every store because they're going back to school. But I also use these. Yep. I've never had a problem with scissors getting on a plane. Rhonda, Priscilla, where in Hobby Lobby can you find the little rolling pin on Mrs. Claus's bakery? It's an ornament. It's in the ornament section of like the hanging up ornaments. Oh, I was supposed to bring that box up here for the stars, too. I'm going to have to run down in a minute. Joyce, I bought the plaid frame from Hobby Lobby to Mount Silent Night on how did you attach it? Magnets, did you take the inner frame sign off first? No, I did um, not take anything apart. I did not do anything but add it on there. Okay. Rewenzel, when will you start finishing with the striped fabric? I'm dying to see it used. 
I'm waiting until it doesn't release until September and I don't know if it's backed up and I don't want to finish anything with it now that you guys can't replicate. So you get your fabric. Right. So as soon as I know that it's starting to hit stores, I'll start using it. I have used it a couple of times. I've used it on Kimberly something for Kimberly and I used it on, I might have used it on our um, October calendar crates. I don't see it right here. I used it on something of ours. Whitney, what are the chances we can get coffee and tea mugs with your logo? That would That'd be, be fun. Cute. Yeah. Josie, can you tell us how you attach back up the truck to the basket? Magnets and washers. You glued the magnet to the or the washer to or the magnet to the basket. Right. Yeah, we need to do a finishing video for the next one. So the magnets magnets are there use. because you only need to one, use two, three, four, one five. magnets one time the washers go on the back of your piece and you just hook it up and I've had this hanging like on the door and places like that where it had a lot of traffic so I used five five washers five magnets um Cindy, what variety are those giant yellow heirloom tomatoes in your video? Oh my gosh, what? do you remember what they were? Pineapples are what I think they are with the red center. They have like red striping through the middle. They are so good. Good job. I have a couple out there that are ready right now. My Everything in my yard stayed alive, thanks to her. Yeah. <laughs> Katrina, Chelsea, did you call your mom Seattle Slu because she kicks her legs? Yeah, she acts like she's riding the horse. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Shelly, can't find the November calendar crate pattern, uh, farm fresh cranberries on your Etsy or fat quarter shop. Can I order it without being in the crates club? It's not in our Etsy shop yet. It won't be a PDF until the 15th of next month. Or I mean, Two of months. just, yeah. of, um, September, October. October. Uh, but you can just October. buy the pattern only on yes. fat quarter shop. That'll come later. They'll post it later. Deborah, do you have a video on how you use the blocks from Michaels to finish a tiered tray item? No, I have not done a video. I can do that though. Julie, does the Stella light have magnification? No, it does not. But I loved this light. I put it in my my you know rolling carry-on bag, and the first of all, the light is so bright and it's so nice that it doesn't have a cord because like I I had it plugged in in the bedroom I slept in. But then I could take the light off of it and take it into their kitchen family room area where I didn't need to worry about because the table's like in the middle of the room. I didn't need to worry about running a cord. I didn't have to ask for an extension cord or anything. And it was perfect. Also, I could put my phone on the base and charge my phone at night so I didn't have to plug in my phone charger. And then it's also got a cord that I plugged in my iPad. So it was like one stop shopping with the light. And I think it would be perfect if you go to a lot of quilt retreats, cross stitch retreats, things like that. I think it would be an amazing addition to your setup. And I noticed Priscilla rubbing her right shoulder area. I get sore there from stitching too. Do you have any recommend, recommended stitches to help with that? So I use this stuff. This right here. Sometimes it's, if my uh, hands Zim's are sore. Zim's Max Freeze Pore Form, Pore Pro. <laughs> Poor formula. But Pro formula. I sometimes put it on my shoulder. I sometimes put it on my hand. It works great. And no, I don't have any exercises that help with it. <laughs> I think mine is from dragging the hose around the yard. The hose is heavy. <laughs> heavy. And I water like from <laughs> the that end the of my yard all the way to the other end of my yard and out. Yes. So with one hose. She has one out in the front that she does some of the front, but it doesn't reach. Just down the front sidewalk. Yep. Well, over there too. Um, Faith, I know you told us before, but I forgot. Where did you purchase your hutch table and chairs? The Stein Hoffels. It's, I think it's just a, like a Wisconsin one. Christy, how do you store your floral picks and branches when you switch displays? They just go in my seasonal bins. And like one bin I'll have a lot of the, the florals and the garlands and things like that. Uh, Dizzy definitely has a lot of changes going on. Are you excited about the new ride at Epcot? Yes, I'm excited about the new ride at Epcot. 
And yes, there's a lot of changes going on and I just hope that they don't ruin it. That's my thoughts. Leanne, <laughs> Silent Night is jaw dropping spectacular. Do you have an Etsy release date known? Uh, October 1st. So I just want to say thank you for all your nice comments last week about how much you loved both pieces and it's so exciting, you know, when you, you see your vision idea come to life and then you guys love it. So especially November calendar crate. <laughs> <laughs> the entire way she was stitching that, she's like, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Yeah. Then she got done with it and she was like, I kind of like it. And then you guys were like fanatical about it. You're like, that's my favorite piece ever. And she's like, okay, I do like it now. <laughs> I, it's so weird because November is my birthday's in that month, and I just am not like, like I I want to November first. I want it to be Christmas. Christmas. So yes, that's my problem. She just doesn't get into that decorating, so it's hard for her to. Yeah, I mean it's a beautiful design. She was just like, but eh. with this one, I think that it it can fit in with your fall stuff, and it can transition into your Christmas starting your your starting your Christmas decorating because it's got the red in it. Yeah. So that was my thoughts on it. Okay. This week on Wednesday, we released, it's somewhere, um, this one, Pumpkin Patch. So we already kind of talked about this. This is from Walmart. Pumpkin Patch is a tiered tray tidbit. And I used a five by seven sticky board. I said all that on my blog when I did the blog post, but I used a five by seven and then glued it down lower so that it would stay. If I saw that there's my hair or yours. It's probably mine. <laughs> <laughs> and then on Friday, Hello, pumpkin. Hello, pumpkin. Oh, with Pumpkin Patch, you also got a uh, bonus shirt that you'll see. She started mm -hmm. um, earlier today, so you'll see that. But hello, pumpkin. This is uh, the Dapper Doodads. It's finished on the Hobby Lobby pumpkin frame. Mm -hmm. The covered button is also Chelsea's checks. That's orange oh and black. Oh, my gosh. Glue. It's because I, oh, I was holding the bow like that. And uh, yesterday, I put in my TikTok, my Instagram, and my Facebook page the video of the the toolbox with them in it. So cute. So. I am that bored. I keep you on. I had the worst dreams last night and couldn't go back to sleep, so my brain is just like a fog. I'm not bored. <laughs> and then this is what I stitched Yay! on the plane. This was, was the third there. release. And when I got home. Mrs. Claus Bakery, it's the next up on the Up on a Pedestal. Mm -hmm. All of you are wondering when that was coming out. Mm -hmm. So Mrs. Claus is baking and she's got lots of gingerbread men, gingerbread houses. I'm gonna take this and I'll show the pattern real close. And then we'll show that. Hello. And everybody's like, where did you get all this stuff on top? It all came from Hobby Lobby, except for these styrofoam um, candy canes. And the wreath, I think, came from Walmart last year. So what I did was I laid down a little wreath. Maybe to show the back of it. I laid down a little wreath so that I could stick all the stuff in there and it would hold it. But I just used a lot of hot glue. This is a pick. The tree is a pick at Hobby Lobby. And then I added the gingerbread buttons and the bows and the vintage trim. Uh, this is an ornament. The gingerbread house is an ornament. The uh, rolling pin is an ornament. And then just bows and then I stuck some of that I didn't have any aqua ribbon but I used that aqua vintage trim to stuff in there so that it would bring in the aqua because I wanted the aqua and the red to be I saw a post about something about the vintage trim how they like scream to themselves that it's Rick Rack we know it's Rick Rack but when Lori Holt named it vintage trim so when you go to search for it on Fat Quarter Shop you have to type in vintage mm -hmm. trim that's why we say vintage and trim. also her Rick Rack is a lot thicker than normal Rick Rack so it's a lot easier to use in the way that we use it I used the I forget what this is called is it like sea glass or something yeah it's pretty and the red on the tree. And then I used the Chelsea's Checks and the Priscilla's Pretty Plaids. And then that Rick Rick to bring in the aqua. I went to go get you another one of those. They didn't have them. They still haven't refilled them. Every time I'm in there, I try to look for it. Yeah, she had to go buy this because I was gone. But I at first, I wasn't going to add the tree. But then I thought, eh, might as well just go. <laughs> It's cute. <laughs> Might as well do it all, right? <laughs> right, right. So I used a whole package of those gingerbread buttons. <laughs> but if you're going to finish your things like this, you know, now's the time to shop for the stuff because pretty soon they, they won't have any more. Yeah, sold yeah. out. 
And then I thought we would show this one more time. Yep, so th these are all releasing. I think it's September 2nd is when the shipping date is for the shops. This is the November calendar crates. And the small piece. I love the small piece. I think y you could stitch this for somebody and give it to them for a gift and they would love it too. But anyway, there's the November calendar crates. And, oh, there it is. And then the Silent Night. And again, thank you for all your nice comments. I, um, when I went to do this, I, I started to add some bows and everything, but I thought that it was enough with the four stars and the, the joy ornament. Yeah. No, Noel. 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 So, there you go. Those are our releases coming to a shop near you next week. Yep. Okay. And that one again, we just dry brushed with some white chalk paint to make it look white. Yeah, and the bad thing is that uh, I'm going to be stuck using that because I like the white wash better than the brown. Oh, goodness. I know. <laughs> Use what you love. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so then we, I stitched those two things and I'm stitching a little special release that we have. <laughs> As well as working on the retreat piece. Those, but all of those I can't show you. Okay. This is the freebie that goes with. Oh, what was it? Yep. Yeah, so the this oh, one pumpkin patch. Pumpkin patch. The pumpkins in the wheelbarrow. I love the bonus the chart. Aqua. I shouldn't call it a freebie. The, this is the bonus chart. So it's pumpkin spice season. Uh, it's just a third page on your. Etsy PDF. on your PDF that you download from Etsy or Fat Quarter Shop. Okay, so I worked on my Santa. Is this one going here? No, no, no. Just, just put it right there. I'll put it away. I worked on my Santa. I got this um, red triangle part of his coat done, plus all the border on his coat. I need to add a couple more green buttons on there, and then I can just fill in his coat. So it's almost done. Yeah. Then you have four more. Yeah, but by the time I get done, it'll be, they'll be bringing out another one. I seem to have slowed down in my production. Did you miss your mom? Gosh. Yes, they all did. Even the cat was just beside himself. <laughs> <laughs> I finally finished all my arrows, or flying geese, as you quilt people like to say. <laughs> and this is Serendipity, the charity stitch along with that quarter shop, so I only have one more row. I've got... One, two, three, four, five, six flowers left to go, and I am done. And they're not these big flowers. They're smaller flowers. Yeah, right? they're like so. the medium size. So Medium. Yeah. But I love the colors, and I love it on their fabric, and I think it's really pretty. Gray check, Lugana, 32 count. Mm -hmm. And the colors I used are on my blog like a month or so ago. Yes. Tons of you are making yard sauce right now. We love seeing that. Love it. So... When, so when I went away, I used this for all my floss. Cross stitch clutch, clutch starlight stitchery. Mm -hmm. And then when I finished oh. the the Mrs. Claus Bakery, I took that floss out and I put the floss in that I'm using for another project. Starlight Stitching Co. I also saw on there that she offers a pattern. So if you want to make your own, you could as well. But really? she Yeah. But she has... Um, a ton of cute ones on there. You can find them on Etsy. They should be linked below. And also when I when I take my things with me, I have this bag in here and I keep my my reader, my reading glasses, plus I use those um, alcohol wipes to clean my glasses and sometimes extra scissors, but I always bring like four pairs of glasses with me just in case something happens. Just <laughs> In case I break them all. You go blind? Do you need four? Look at how it is around here. I probably have 30 pairs of them scattered around here. And I'm always like, does anybody see it in my glasses? <laughs> yeah, <it's> fine <laughs> grandma's glasses. <laughs> but it works out really good. And you can get these bags at Fat Quarter Shop. Yep. And you could use those alone as a uh, project bag. Right, especially like for the ornaments and things. Oh, gosh. So this is what I'm stitching, and I can't show you any more than that, but if you've stitched any of the other ones, you probably know what this is for. And we are a tad bit behind. We are. <laughs> Deadlines. You know, sometimes they're just... <laughs> sometimes somebody doesn't read the emails. 
<laughs> Sorry. We and need a joint calendar is what we need. We, we do. do. We need an assistant. Remember, I bought that big chalkboard. Yeah, it's out there. You right. said you'd have one of the no. boys hang it up. I <laughs> never said that. <laughs> Anyway, the air conditioning is still working. Like I said, this is what came on the plane with me and then filled with my project bags and that was it. So I want to show you this light. Did and I'm going to take this with me today because I'm going to watch the grandsons play football and Hunter's driving me. So I'm going to take my stitching. What? You're not going to be able to stitch in his car. A hundred percent you will not be able to stitch in his car. Well, Hunter drives there. like a bat out of hell. <laughs> he does it, not. Yes, he does. He has a little race car that he loves to just like fly mom. Okay, so this is the cord that you can plug in, and this is how All I right, charge. Let me talk about this. I charge my <laughs> iPad. The, the last video, you were like, <laughs> All right, you got a micro USB. So this which is what she my portable charger. Mary and Joseph. Uh, <laughs> USB-C, which is a lot of newer Androids. This is also my new iPad, so you could use that. And then an iPhone, Apple, typical charger on there. Also a wireless charger on the base. So if your phone has wireless capability, it doesn't just have to be iPhone like she's, wow. Ah, uh, like she said last week, it'll charge. Okay, so okay. there you go. Look, is this the look, highest? I don't know. But do you need well, it any higher? Like, oh, that's how much charge you have. Mm -hmm. uh, so the this down here, this down here show. Oh, you can't even see it. Uh, it's, it's okay. This down here. Well, they can't see now. <laughs> this down here shows your battery life. Mm -hmm. There's different modes on here. So again, like the last one, blue, yellow. But I haven't charged it since Monday. Mm -hmm. Monday. Yeah, this is bright. Sorry, yeah, it's very bright. don't look at the light. I think it's brighter than any light we have. But when you look at like the black, when you look at like the black fabric, ooh, wow. It's good. I like it. Mm -hmm. But anyway, you just pick this up like this and you can take it in any room and you just leave this. And this is where I charge my phone. Yeah, she bounces from room to room for stitching with, with the better light. Like her front window has really good light, but then she'll go to the back sliding glass door when the sun has moved and stitch back there. She bounces around. I have one spot that I can stitch in my house. And I don't use the light during the day at all. But I, this I only would use be it good at night because unless it's like a rainy day or the way our couch is set up, I have to sit with my table on my right and I have to drag my cord over me to have my light on my left because I stitch with my right hand. So there's a shadow all the time. So that would be excellent. So I might go order one of those actually. Have they talked about a coupon code? But they have not gotten back to me. I have to ask them about that. Okay. This is the Stella Go <laughs> from Stella Lights. I'll be waiting. And Chelsea will link Stella below. Below. But I loved it. Um, Some haul that we, mom got us this week. So I said that I was looking for this and she found it yesterday, Cuddle Weather. And this, I don't know how to explain this color. It's like a mauve maroon -y, right? Yeah, like, it's, it's like maroon. Yeah, but... And see, I didn't buy that one because I, I don't know that I'm into that, like, with my foe. I don't know. This color? Yeah. Well, this and the yellow, that, like, mustardy yellow, that hollow oh, sunshine that. I have, they look so cute together in my cabinet. I was like, oh, I love those colors. What, else, what other cup do you have that's that side color? I don't um, have any. Gosh. All right, and then we, we both got this one. Fall y'all. Fall y'all in this, like, um, vintage green. I love it. It's pretty. Yeah, I got that one, too. And then I got Hello Fall in the taller one. I got Hocus Pocus with the purple insides. And then she got this one. Not that one. The other one. <laughs> she went on a buying spree. <laughs> she hadn't been to the store in a long time. And then I was uh, like talking to Chelsea on FaceTime, you know, hoping that she could see something. And then this lady put on the, the cart, you know, they put everything out. She put this box and I was like, you can't shop from the cart. <laughs> one time at Goodwill. Right. One year at Goodwill. I mean, it was probably 10 years ago, but we still think about it. <laughs> we got in trouble. Mom got in trouble. She was like picking through the cart and they were like yelled at her. Did you see how the McDonald went to Tom Girardi's to pick up her item yesterday? Yes, it's but I haven't watched the whole thing. Oh, I watched her Patreon. <laughs> but anyway, it's a scaredy cat, and then the the little white one says, hey, boo. <laughs> so Harlow has his first cup. I didn't have any cat cups. You didn't? No. Yeah. Why would I have a cat cup? 
Because you just got Harlow. I figured you would have gone out and bought everything. I haven't. I don't have any cat cups. Oh, well, now I know to look for those for you. No, I don't need any more. <laughs> He's else? got his one. What else were we going to show? Uh, okay, so then we got some gifts this week. I don't yes. think there's anything else to, to show there. Um, this is at Quarter Shops. So this is the Fine Floss. Yep, we can give away that. Is my little scissors still here or did I take them? Did you eat your... Oh, you want some goldfish? Yeah. Hearty breakfast. Yeah, him. That's Piper. That's her. her. You can't hold her, baby. No, he wants to give her one. Can oh, you, you want to give her one? Yeah. Come over on my I, side. We'll think about it. Uh, this is banana, oh, pretty. banana Mania. These are silk. So Fine Floss is a uh, Floss of the Month club that you can get through uh, fatquartershop.com. This is their bougie floss. This is the banana mania. You're, oh, I said come over this way because I know you got a mess over there. Here you go. Honey. So that'll be included in our giveaways. So um, this year was the first year that I grew cantaloupes. And remember at first I said that they looked like honeydews? Well, they were ripe and oh my goodness, they are so good. And they're big, they're like this big. So Cash helped me pick one the other day. And then I've got tons of that Tramoncino squash. Did you eat Grandma's melon? Was it good? Yeah. How good was it? But I took that Tramoncino yeah. and I sliced it up really thin with a little bit of onion and sauteed Aww. it in olive oil and butter, like I told you, because we had had it you in did? a restaurant. Oh my goodness, it was so good. But you just have to slice it really, really thin. Yeah. Okay. All right. Then our friend Susan. Mm -hmm. Is this Susan? No, this is... Oh, this is a thank you card that we received from one of the viewers that won. There we go. Uh, then, thank you so much. All right, come here. This so is your mom can do this. From our friend Susan. Just she, one. she met up with mom when they went to Disney. Look at, she gave you a gift too, Popushke. Look. What are those? Puppies. Yeah, but stickers. 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 Say thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, we had fun with stickers the other day. He put them all over my face. That's why I have pimples. Um, <laughs> then she made this cute card. Oh my goodness. That's so cute. I love the little gingham background too. Yeah, that's Grandma's new light. Do you like it? Yeah, it's pretty bright. And then she got these cute... Um, Flower and Garden Festival bags. They're figment. Super, super cute. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. Thank we you, can't Susan. wait to use these. We're going to use them for cross stitch bags, but. She's always the nicest. Yes. She she and her husband took Ma to um, hey. the Disney shop, right? Mm -hmm. Then. Hey. Oh, that was for Susan. Hey. Okay. Trade of Carol. Okay. She got glow in the dark bags. Look at these. These go perfect. With, oh wow! Look at the kitties. That looks like Harlow. Mm -hmm. Harlow. They both look like Harlow. Yeah, Harlow. Harlow. So these are her Halloween bags, and these are in her Etsy shop. These are amazing. Thank you so much, Carol and Chelsea. Thank I'll you. link her Etsy shop below. We have a Loki kitty that looks just like Harlow, and he just. He, every time we see her, where's Loki? Where's Loki? Playing with my light. We're playing with my light. Yeah, that's Grandma's light. We're playing with my light. All right, then this is from Barbara. And she's going to the retreat, the Starbucks retreat. The Starbucks retreat. She's stitching with Grammy Custom Sewing. Mm -hmm. um, Does she have an Etsy? She, she's on Instagram. No, I don't see any Etsy. Yeah, no. no, Grandma doesn't know how to play. I just tell you where. Okay, and then she Good made me. us these beautiful Grandma? bags. Look at this chalk art on the back. So cute. And I love this little braided tail. This is awesome. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Very nice. Thank you so much. We will see you there. 
I have to look up the dates for that. When are we going? When are we leaving? Put it in our calendar. All right, show those pads. I'm going to. I'm going to make sure I didn't just drop something. No. All right, we'll end that box right there. From okay. Shelly. I on Saturday dropped off um, some charts to Black Cat Stitchery, and they wanted to do um, some pads. They gave us quite a few of these to give away. Thank you so much, Erica and team. So they are cute little cross-stitch notepads. They say things to do after cross-stitch. Super cute. Then our friend Shelly. Shelly sent, oh, I know. Shelly sent us, I was like, what could this possibly be? But this, this was like better than opening diamonds. <laughs> I wouldn't, I would not go that far. I would. <laughs> I'm not putting that on record. This Diamond whole box food. is full of blocks. Yes, uh, the blocks from Michael's. Michael's. Yes, thank you so much, Shelly. That was so yeah. nice of you, because ours hasn't had any for a long time. So. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, if you are attending the Starbucks retreat, get stitching on that retreat piece. Mm -hmm. Don't be a slacker. Um, <laughs> we, oh, this stuff too. Wait, hold up. All right, then we have the Floss Fix. Floss Fix is another Floss of the Month Club. This is Classic Color Works. Mom already opened one for us. So this is the August 2021 Club, and it is Pale Ooh. Silver, Toasted Marshmallow, Wild Oats, Lighthouse, Shabby Sheep, Thundercloud, and Bakington. We love Bakington. Yes. Toasted Marshmallow we've used before. Uh, thundercloud we've used in something mm -hmm. so these are amazing neutrals that you can use that that baking tin really shows up as gray on black fabric it doesn't give the purplish or blue tints that a lot save one of those to get away yeah you gotta do it grandma is not not trained in playing games in that green bag that then Starlight Stitching Co. that we just talked about. She sent us two more. She sent us two more. So she's Starlight Stitching Co. on Etsy. Um, and she did these, which will be perfect for Silent Money. Oops. So again, they have the zipper front, and that's where mom keeps her little scissors. Oh, it says it. You can keep your... It says Silent Night. Um, like skeins of floss. I stop playing with my light. If you wanted to. And then it opens up with snaps. This you can poke your needle through and then in here just attach your your threads. And then it's got this zipper pouch, like I said, where you can store your thread until you need it or store extras of your thread. Or like me, I have needles and extra little scissors in mine plus some extra threads. But she wrote us a really nice note and she appreciates everyone shopping with her. Oh, that's very, very nice and card. Thank you. Chelsea will link her shop below too. Starlight Stitching Co. on Etsy. All right. We had giveaways last week. Uh, the first one was three opportunities. Remember if you win, um, I think my email is pretty cleared up. So you don't have to email within 24 hours anymore. I think it's all set unless you, you should get a shipping notification from stamps.com if it's something, what? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's good. Um, all right, so that first one was fall jar. You'll receive the, that as a PDF. Old fish. Uh, fall jar, scarecrow hanging with his little banner of leaves and acorns. Crystal Longer, Taylin A. H. and Tori Mason, congratulations. Next up was the doodad, and this is also a PDF, three opportunities to win this. This was pumpkin pie. Finished on a block from Menards. I saw somebody post that they went to Menards and mm -hmm. got a finishing haul. And they're like, I don't know. I need to look here now. Uh, Pam Pepper, Marcy Courtney, and Jody Forston. We were surprised with how cute everything was. And it was relatively inexpensive mm -hmm. as far as, you know, sometimes there was a markup on that decor stuff there. And sometimes you just need something a little different than Hobby Lobby. Not right? all the time. My but used to have a lot, but I haven't seen anything. I've been, I think, three yeah, times. Huh? I will play this too. Alright, well, uh, how about you go over there on the couch and play? No, look, this. this. <laughs> look at the cats over there. Huh? Sam? The next up was from Fat Quarter Shop, Kimberly nice and Team. Time. Thank you, Kimberly and Team, for the giveaways. Uh, this was the All the Trim. So you, this is a mystery series. All the trimmings? All the trimmings, yes. I shortened it on here. <laughs> All the trimmings. Um, and you can get the pattern on the Jolly Jabber, I believe. It's a PDF, I think. 
Um, this one, you're oh, getting a bag of random color, gray, green, or red. The 24, uh, 14 count Ada, my brain. The DMC floss that you need for it. And then this beautiful needle minder of the mistletoe, Holly, Holly, maybe. Uh, that goes to Bev McGinnis, Kim Hill, Catherine Crabtree, Shelly Hamblin, and Vicki Strait. Yeah, I'm gonna play. I want play this. I don't know how to play. Sorry, kid. Yeah. Can you go ask Uncle Parker? Yeah. Okay, go ask him. Go tell him Grandma said to wake up. <laughs> tell him. <laughs> Say he, he has to. <laughs> Um, okay, then all the trimmings, you'll get linen. So this is going to be a 28 count linen. This is chalkboard black. You have the Weeks Dye Works thread pack, and you have the beautiful needle minder as well. This goes to Amanda Badger, Joe Lee, J-O and then space L-E-E, -E, Lori Treeb, Angie Cutler, and Melissa K Cahill, C-A-H-I-L-L, C -A -H -I -L -L, sorry. Next sleeve was the... Royal Purple Fine Floss. This goes to Amanda Miles. Next, your choice of PDF or uh, printed pattern of how, how Does Your Garden Grow? That goes to Good Enough for Oats, Andrea Jankovic, and Romy Delgado. Then we had Boo to You. Stacey Stanfield, Nancy Berry, Joanne Toby, Christine Hufford, and Connie Allman. And again, that one, uh, you can choose a PDF or I can mail a chart to you. You just let me know what's easiest That's for you. I don't know. What was, what was I saying that for? PDF. I have yeah. <laughs> the little. What? <laughs> Those are available in paper and also PDFs, paper in stores and PDFs through us. Yes. Ah. Uh, Next, we have giveaways for this week. So, you're gonna be thinking of a question. The first one is going to be three opportunities to win pumpkin patch and you'll also receive the bonus chart. That's number one. I like went to go read off winners. There's no winners for this. <laughs> number one is three opportunities to win pumpkin patch plus the bonus chart. There's a pumpkin here somewhere. What? <laughs> She took her giggle. Oh, somebody said that their so they won something and they were emailing us and they said their husband asks all the time if we've been drinking. <laughs> so I signed our email to sober chicks. <laughs> nope, this is just us. I don't drink. Um, yeah, me either. Number two is <laughs> <laughs> I don't like have I don't. I mean, socially, I'll have a beer or something, but I'm a big lightweight, so. Number two is uh, three opportunities to win Hello Pumpkin. It's okay. It's fine. You're <laughs> fine. <laughs> so. Number three is uh, from Fat Quarter Shop. Thank you, Kimberly and team. That's going to be the opportunity to win the floss fix. This was the light silver yep. um, option. Cream. Yep. Bakington. It's okay. Number four is going to be the fine floss. And that was what colors? Purples. No. Oh, yellows. 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 Banana mania. Yeah, Banana yellows. mania. That's number four. Number five is three opportunities again to win this beautiful belt book. Maybe There's a purple. There's the purples? Yeah. Thank you. He found the purples. Thank you. Okay. Welcome. Number five is three opportunities to win this beautiful book, a scrapbook of quilts by Joanna Figueroa and Carrie Nelson. Number six. Do you need help? You want to sit by Grandma? Three feet by four. Three feet by four. Number six is two opportunities to win this great bundle again, Cross Stitch University. I don't know how to do it. So you get the scissors, you get the needles, you get the Ada, you get the uh, pattern. Two opportunities to win number six. Number seven is also Cross Stitch University. It is um, two opportunities to win the pattern only. Number eight is one, two, three, four, five opportunities to win stitchography. And this is, um, you can see the finishing piece of this was that 
spool. spool. Wooden spool. That was number eight, right? Mm -hmm. And then number nine is going to be three opportunities to pick a chart from our Etsy shop. Your choice, pick a chart, any chart. Okay, and then number 10, we'll do oh. these. Mm. Number 10 is... Uh, Why? You can do that one. Why? Because we don't have a lot of those. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Number 10 will be uh, three opportunities to win pumpkin picking day. And you can do a PDF or you can do a printed copy. Mm -hmm. These are like right in the middle between where I need to order more or just keep it because the seasons, like, okay. you know, okay. that's why I'm not saying I don't have enough or we can't order more. We can always order more, <laughs> but we're at that like little point. Um, okay. So there's 10 giveaways. You're going to answer where you spend your stitching. No, or we just did week. that. Oh, okay. Um. Um. Let's do your. Hey, don't be. Your... Did oh, you see her just look at growling her? at him? Oh my goodness. <laughs> she wasn't growling. She just gave him a dirty look. Same. <laughs> We want to ask what their stitchy setup looks like, if they use the light, if they don't use the light, because we talked a lot about that. I was thinking more of like, um, what's your last piece that you fully finished? Oh yeah, because a lot of people are just getting into finishing their projects, mm -hmm. which is perfect. You get them out from under the bed, out of the closet, hanging up, wherever they are, and yes. slap them on something. And we love seeing your projects, so keep posting them in our stitching group and Instagram and tagging us. We love seeing them. Yes. I've seen a lot of really pretty ones. The back of the truck this week. Very nice. Yes. Yes. And Be all nice. of the calendar crates. And if you aren't a member of our stitching group on Facebook, join our stitching group. It's um, Stitching with Housewives. Yep. Yeah. And there's two questions, and they're both sitting here on the table. Well, one's in my lap, one's on Cash, the table. Cash, Piper, <laughs> or Ronnie, or Hunter, or Harlow. <laughs> um, he's almost as big as Grandma now. <laughs> He's not. He is. He can barely fit on your lap. He's so big. He got a new balance bike this week too. So I, it was really hot outside this week. So I let him just ride it inside. Um, oh my gosh. <laughs> just down the hall because it, oh, do you know what a balance bike is? It's a bike with no pedals so okay. they can learn how to balance. Okay. No, they didn't have those kind of things. I know. Yeah. I know. I didn't okay. think he needed it either. I, we bought him a regular bike to begin with and he has no idea how to do it. He just pushes on the, the back pedal. So It'll be fine. We'll learn how to do this. Yeah, but how do you ride it? You just stand there? And you push off. Then you get him a scooter. He has one of those. <laughs> Kid has everything. Um, okay, so we appreciate you spending your time with us. We will, you turn, your turn. Okay, so follow us on Instagram at Priscilla Blaine at Chelsea356, Priscilla's2000 on Facebook, and Priscilla's2000 at blogspot.com. At Priscilla Blaine on TikTok. Oh my goodness. Anyway, or she dances, fancy la, 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 whipped cream. No, okay. <laughs> she thinks she's not. <laughs> she's ready to launch at me. She does not like me. She bites me now when I walk in the door. Rude. It's because she's skinny now. Yeah, right. She is. So she has trimmed out. Let's show me. You want to show him? <laughs> All right. Look at her. She's trimmed down a lot. She doesn't have those big shoulders anymore. No, she's she's, looking, she's normal. She's looking good. How do you feel, Piper? <laughs> do you feel good? She's crabby. Yes, you feel good. You're hungry, aren't you? Yeah. You're hungry. I would give you food if you didn't bite me. And she'd be 400 pounds. I'd give you she was strips. like a little waddling cockroach. <laughs> <She> <laughs> <does>. <laughs> <laughs> Away from Cass. She's not going to hurt you. I know. <laughs> you're scared of her. <laughs> anyway. Raise your animals better. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> First Calvin, now her. So a answer the question, what, what piece you is your most recent fully finished piece? Yeah. Yours is Hello Pumpkin. Oh, no. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was we thinking it was the gingerbread yes, thing. Two days ago. That came after the gingerbread thing? Yeah, yeah. Well, the same day. Okay. Yes, but that was first and then this. 
<laughs> um, Mrs. Claus Bakery is going to be included with the September releases. Again, uh, yes. your stores have all that info. They got it earlier this week. So and if a lot of shops or offer pre-orders and they, yeah. so yeah, get yourself on the list if you want it. Yeah, I see. Yeah, they just. <laughs> He's playing Crash Bandicoot. Yep. <laughs> He's very good at it. All right. Anyway, so the moral of the story is I loved the light. I had a great oh, time yeah. on my trip. I can't wait to go again and see the baby and the, her parents, of course. <laughs> <laughs> and, the, and the pups. It was so funny. They they were so excited to see me. He he tells them that grandma's coming and they they know. They flip out. Yeah. She had to leave her door open so Nala could come in in the yeah. morning. <laughs> <laughs> It's very funny. Mm -hmm. um, but Jojo's like just getting more of a, more of a personality. Mm -hmm. um, she tried FaceTiming Cash, but Cash was in a mood. He had donuts and did not want to talk to anyone. <laughs> <laughs> in a mood. Um, okay, so we will see you again next week. We're going to try to hopefully fit in a garden tour this week. Mm -hmm. The weather's been super hot and super sunny, so even when she waters and stuff, it just looks like everything. My grass still like, has a lot of dead spots, but it, it, grass we, just have to, Who cares? we just have to uh, pretend it's not. Yeah, and um, a, a lot of my plants don't look in their prime anymore, so we should have done it last month, but we just didn't have time and with the weather and... You guys know. all understand. I think they all understand. They get yeah. it. Um, and also, I was the caretaker, so some... <laughs> I asked Parker to water one day out of the <laughs> however many. And if uh, my plants don't get watered, like, within an hour of the same time that they got watered yesterday, they revolt, and they're just like... <sighs> I mean, I told my boyfriend I was going to have to go and probably buy a thousand dollars worth of plants. Because he's like, how would they die in a day? And I was like, I don't know. She must like baby them because they are all dead. He was on the phone FaceTiming her and I was like, stay out there because the front looked good. The backyard though was just like, and I was like, oh my God, I don't know what to do. So I just like soaked them. I went back and forth in this yard three times soaking every basket. And I was like, oh God, they better make it. I said a lot of prayers that night for the plants. They, I came back the next day though and they were... Just perky, so it was fine. Yeah, it was really hot. Really. <laughs> really hot. Uh, All right. It stormed that day, though, too. So you got back, and you couldn't even see if your plants were okay because it, it rained really hard mm -hmm. uh, that evening that you were coming in. You just missed it when you got on the plane. Mm -hmm. Oh, her plane, she w it was, like, empty, which yep. was nice, on the way there and the yeah, way back. There was nobody within three rows of me on the way home. It's awesome. <laughs> she loved it. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> Probably not good for the airline industry, yeah. but she liked it. And the airport that she went to was super easy because there's mm -hmm. a few gates. She had a good time. It was yep. good. All right. All right. We've talked enough. We will see you next week. Do you want to say anything else? I can't think of anything. All right. We'll all see right, you next week. Thank you week. again for all your nice comments last week about the designs. We, we, we totally appreciate it. Cash, can you say bye, friends? Bye, friends. Bye. Can, can you blow my kiss? play this game with them? Yeah. Can you blow my kiss? <laughs> no. Look up from your game. Pause it and blow him a kiss. Can you blow him a kiss, Piper? <laughs> okay, we'll see you next time. Bye.